investigation in an apparent double murder suicide in South Jordan. Today, police released the identities of the victims as eight year old Seth Osborne, his brother, 10 year old Ezra Osborne. Police say the preliminary autopsy results results indicate that the boy's father, 41 year old Brian Osborne, shot and killed the two boys before shooting himself. This all happened yesterday near 106 South and 43rd West there in South Jordan. ABC 4's Jared Jotanini spoke with neighbors on how they're coping with the tragedy. A very difficult time for this tight knit community who's rallying support for the victim's family. So much unrest and so many problems. It's just it's it's so hard to bear another tragedy. Casey Ruff and this South Jordan community hearts are breaking over the loss of two young boys. Police say Tuesday the boy's father shot and killed them before turning the gun on himself. Police investigating as a double murder suicide. Police say the father was looking after the kids and that the parents are divorced. Police say the mother was the one who called 911. It's so hard to bear another tragedy in this close home. The community tying blue ribbons around trees, light poles and stop signs to remember the two boys lives. Any sign of solidarity and support for people that are having hard times, I think is amazing. At last check, a GoFundMe for the victims has raised more than $25,000. This incident marks the third deadly domestic violence among the Wasatch Front in the past week. Jared Jotinini, ABC4 News. Just heartbreaking. We do want to let you know that if you or someone you know is experiencing domestic violence, there are resources available right now. For an emergency, call 911, but you can also call the Utah Domestic Violence Coalition hotline at 1-800-897-5465.